with growing concern over our grocery store workers. Tonight, we know three giant employees have tested positive for COVID-19. According to a giant spokesperson, all three of them worked at the grocery store in the 4300 block of Connecticut Avenue in Northwest DC. That is right next to the Van Ness Metro Station. Delia Gonzalez joins us now live with what she's learned. Delia. Hey, Les, let me first remind everyone out there that according to the DC Health Department, these grocery stores are not required to tell you, the shopper, if an employee tests positive. We are sharing this information with you this evening because I received a tip. I reached out to Giant and then got some answers. It was another busy shopping day at the Giant at Connecticut and Van Ness as WSA 9 confirmed that three employees tested positive for COVID-19. So here's what you need to know. A company spokesperson says the most recent associate to test positive last worked in the grocery store this past Friday, May 15th. And while he did not provide details, the spokesperson said the store was disinfected. Here's the rest of his statement. Quote, we immediately took the precaution of requiring this associate as well as additional associates that were working with the affected individual to quarantine themselves. They will all receive sick pay during their period of recovery and quarantine. We've been in communication with Giant throughout the crisis on an almost daily basis. After growing concerns about safety at our grocery stores, D.C. Mayor Muriel Bowser issued an order that required shoppers wear masks at all times and that all grocery stores implement safety protocols like one-way lanes and limiting customers inside. The giant spokesperson said they are following those guidelines and have installed plexiglass shields at the pharmacy, customer service desk and registers and distributed PPE to all employees at all locations throughout the DMV. She called me, she says, Mommy, I can barely breathe. Those safety measures at Giant were put in place after the April 1st death of Leilani Jordan, a 27-year-old woman who worked through the disability program at the Giant in Largo, Maryland. The union says safety of their members throughout the DMV is a top priority. There's some talk of companies, including Giant, of loosening the restrictions on the number of customers in stores and you know, these latest cases just show that it's clearly premature to be loosening any safety protocols right now. A giant spokesperson did not respond when I asked if they were considering loosening those restrictions. I can tell you about three weeks ago, D.C.'s mayor did extend free COVID-19 case uh, testing, I should say, to asymptomatic grocery workers. Jonathan Williams from the union that you heard from in that piece says now they're waiting for Virginia and Maryland to follow suit. We're live in Southeast, Delia Gonsalves, WUSA 9.